So then, crap me skull again. Just a little quack again. Let's talk about crocodilians. First of all, crocodilidae. So crocodiles, everybody, everybody knows that. Gavialidae. So gharials. There are just two species, right? One has a bump, the other don't. One lives in India, the other in Indonesia. And alligatoridae. It's two subfamilies, right? the caimans and the alligators. Today's mind blow. Alligatorinae. You probably know the American alligator. You know, spreading freedom across the Everglades, chilling in the sewers, uh, wiping under the ice, everybody knows that. But did you know there is another species of alligator across the Pacific Ocean? <laughs> How the frick did you got there, man? Alligator sinensis. Uh, looks kind of like the American counterpart, just a wee bit smaller, and is endemic to just one part of China. So, just this part of China. Now you're thinking, why are there alligators in, in China? Well, the answer is, again, bearing straight excuse, man. Neither of them can tolerate salt water, so no swimmy swimmy across the Pacific. Now, the weird thing is, fossils have been found in Japan. Uh, the date to three million years ago, but the fossils of North America predate those in Asia, those we have right now. So, they need to have to disperse to Asia. What the flip, man? I'm getting more mind blown. Some fossil species found farther north in America, and those predate the first alligators in China by millions of years. I found this Reddit post. I'm just reading it. <laughs> um, r slash ask science. Huh. So some ancestor of the gators uh, went over the strait. The other one didn't. And now you have the American and the Chinese alligator. That's, I don't know, it just cracks me head a little bit. 